The Smith's Detection X-ray systems also have a very neat feature called High Spot. This is another one of their automatic um, detection capabilities that the systems have. This one's a little bit stranger than the other ones for high density, which is for your guns, uh, metal pipe bombs, and hand grenades, and also your explosive exact inspection, which is specifically for organic-based explosives. High Spot is looking for extremely dense areas inside of the X-ray image or the bag you just X-rayed. This is going to be something so dense that x-rays are not coming through it and it's almost going to show up in a black color on your x-ray screen. Anytime you see that where you're getting a black color, an extremely dark blue that you can't see through it, something incredibly dense is inside that person's bag and that's just not normal and that needs to be investigated. This is where high spot comes in. It's going to highlight that area for you and typically if it's that dense it'll put a light blue box around it but you'll also get the high density alert purple box around it too and we're going to show you an example of that. So once this triggers what high spot is actually going to do is actually flash in just that area on the screen from normal view to high penetration view. Normal view, high penetration view. It'll keep flashing back and forth between the two and what it's trying to do is let you see if there's something behind that very dense material. Now what they'll try to do and what they've done historically, terrorists and criminals have tried to use something like lead, which is an extremely dense material and blocks x-rays, to try to mask some sort of threat so you can't see it. Um, that's what this detection feature is designed to do, is let you see through that material. Now it only works up to about two millimeter thickness of lead. Once you start getting past that, it won't even penetrate that. That bag has to be open. Has to be open, it has to be searched because it's not gonna be able to see through it. So what we have is a, a test to show for you. We have a backpack that has lead inside of it with a handgun hidden behind the lead. And what we're gonna try to do is to um, see if the high spot feature will allow us to see through the lead and actually find that gun that's hidden behind it. So we'll go ahead and start the x-ray. We'll take our backpack, we will run it through the x-ray system, and you should see the high spot feature automatically kick in, which we did. So same thing, it's going to automatically stop the belt, lock the item inside the tunnel so they can't get access to it, and it's going to say suspicious object detected. Now you've got the light blue box around the very dark, dense area, which is the lead, just not normal to see that and it's actually flashing, and I don't know if you can see it where it's flashing, but it's actually showing you the North American Arms Little 22 pistol that's behind the lead. So what High Spot is doing is allowing you to see, one, there's an area of concern here based on extremely high density, two, what is potentially behind that by flashing it into high penetration, and it's letting us see that North American Arms 22 pistol behind it. So in this scenario, it worked perfectly, and allows you to catch this threat and not let it into your facility.